So new tonight, MTA police turning to the public for help after an unprovoked attack in broad daylight. It all happened inside a busy Grand Central this morning. Police say a nine year old was with her mom inside the dining hall when a man randomly approached them and punched that little girl in her face. News 4's Jessica Cunnington live a bit town with more on what we know about the suspect tonight. Jessica. And Gus, first of all, what we do know is that that suspect is in custody. The MTA confirming that, saying he was arrested about 20 minutes ago. But we're also learning that this is the second time in about a week and a half that this suspect is accused of randomly punching someone inside Grand Central. The MTA police says this time it was a nine-year-old girl from the Bronx. It was just before noon Saturday. A nine year old girl and her mom were standing here in the dining concourse of Grand Central when MTA police say this man, out of nowhere, punches the young girl in the face. A few minutes later, Brooke Jibo walked into work at a coffee shop here. My coworkers were like, oh my God, like a child got punched today in front of Tartinery. And I was like, wow, that's, that's terrible. Like, who was it? And it's like, it's this guy who's given us problems before. MTA police identifying the man as 30 year old John Carlos Zarzuela. He got away before the girl from the Bronx was taken to the hospital. It could happen any time, you never know. So especially if you're a woman, like I said, or a child. Court records show Zarzuela was arrested by MTA police on April 4th and charged with assault. A law enforcement source telling News 4 Zarzuela randomly punched a 54 year old woman inside Grand Central, breaking her nose. In that case, Case, the source says a judge set bail at $2,500 cash. He went to jail and on April 9th went in front of a different judge and was released. Just four days later, MTA police say he was back at Grand Central, now accused of another attack. He like fake like swings at people sometimes, but I guess he's like actually swinging at people now. Jibo has only been working here for about a year and is not surprised to hear about another violent incident. Back on Christmas, two teenage tourists were stabbed in an unprovoked attack attack here. There is a very big like mental health crisis here obviously and like like the reform for that isn't you know gonna just like change fast so I don't know it's it's a very nuanced issue. The MTA communications director saying it doesn't make any sense that this guy who was recently released after being charged with randomly punching someone else should be back in a public space where he can attack others especially children. The people responsible for the criminal justice system need to learn from this episode before more innocent people become victims. Is he gonna get caught and even if he gets caught what's gonna happen? And again, the MTA telling us tonight that Zarzuela is in custody, that he was arrested at the 125th Street Lexington Avenue subway station. He is being charged with assault in the second degree. Live in Midtown, I'm Jessica Cunnington, News 4 New York.